We're gonna meet with somebody, aren't we? Oh, I guess so. It's just me, Frisk. Nope, it's Papyrus. <laughs> hey, buddy. Yo, Ben. Allow me to tell you about some things, some complex things. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the Great Papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are human. I must capture you. Then, I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. Okay, fight time, I guess. Papyrus blocks the way. Well, you know what? Let's flirt to him. Ooh, Ooh la la. la. I'm not gonna insult him. Maybe I will. What? F flirting? So you're finally feeling your ultimate feelings. Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. I have zero redeeming qualities. I can make spaghetti. Oh no, you're meeting all my standards! I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date later after I capture you. Uh, maybe. Maybe not, maybe not in this video, but maybe after, I don't know. Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Uh, I'll flirt to you. Oh no! Let's date later after I capture you. Oh. Okay, maybe that's not what we need to do. Maybe we gotta mercy and spare him. So you won't fight. Then let's see if you can handle the my fabled blue attack. Your what? <laughs> well, that's not too bad, actually. That's quite easy. I, I just sit here and do nothing. Don't have to touch them. <laughs> <laughs> It's kind of- Oh, oh! Oh, I didn't know we transitioned to this. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> okay, well now we're starting to get serious. I'm gonna spare you. Hmm, I wonder what I should wear. Okay, the music is getting really good here. Music's starting to pick up. Which I like. I really like that. Mapyrus stabs mar mar marinara sauce behind his ear. What, I'm not thinking about that date thing. Oh, really? You sound like you are. But I don't know. Whoa! 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 I made it. Oh, yeah, I gotta talk because I'm gonna get copyright if I don't talk. Papyrus stabs MTT brand bitch and cream behind his ear. This music's really freaking good. Yeah! Don't make me use my special attack! Oh, God, that sounds bad. Ow. I messed that one up. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you're start it's starting to get a little dodgy. But I'm gonna Papyrus stabs entity brand anime powder behind his ear. Oh boy, anime! I can almost taste my future popularity. Yeah, but you're probably gonna kill me doing that, which is not very great. Okay. Ooh. Hello there. Oh god, I didn't see that one. I was looking away. Kinda. Papyrus stabs NTD brand cute juice behind his ear. Okay. Papyrus, head of the Royal Guard! Oh, really? Oh, God. Okay. Now we're starting to get a little serious. Alright, I need- I need something to eat. How about an ice cream? Love yourself. I love you. You recovered 15 HP. How nice. Papyrus Unparalleled Spaghetti Store! Okay. Papyrus, you're getting a little aggressive here. Undying will be really proud of me. Oh yes, Undying. I forgot we got to meet with her later. Oh crap. Ugh. 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 Okay, there we go. Realize he doesn't have ears. Okay, well, the king will trim his a hedge in the shape of my smile. Yeah, because your smile's very iconic. I. Mmm. 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 Oh, Paris is considering his options. Yeah, I'm considering my option of eating some food right now. Okay. My brother will, well, 
He won't change very much. Okay, I see what we gotta do here. There we go. The virus is trying hard to play it cool. How about this? I'll have lots of Amires, but... But what? But what, Papyrus? Alright. Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? I don't know, maybe. Whoa, okay, we're getting a little trippy now. Okay, got through that. Alright, someone like you is really rare. Yeah, I'm pretty- I'm quite a rare person. To like, if you will. <gasps> okay. Getting trippy there. Alright. And dating might be kinda hard! It could. Okay. D I didn't- Why did I not- I should've expected that, okay. He res- He whispers, Nyehehe. Nyehehe. I'm Papyrus, and I'm popular. Can't really hear myself because of how loud this music is, which is great, but... I don't know, after you're captured and sent away... I might die. You're too weak. I was easily able to. Uh, yikes. I will now send you to the capture zone. Or, as Sans calls it, our garage? You're in, dog you're in the doghouse now. No! Why me? Okay, well, at least I get to check it out then. It's a note for Papyrus. Sorry, I have to lock you in the guest room until Undying arrives. Feel free to make yourself at home. Refreshments and accom accommodations have been provided. Nearly yours, Papyrus. Well, that's not good. I guess we're not ending the video just yet. Unfortunately. Speaking of unfortunately, it's just dry food. I didn't know it was going to say that. It's a squeaky chew toy. It's too small to sleep on. Well, what can I do now? I All I have to do... Can I escape from the window? No. Oh, mouse. Mouse? There's no mouse to save me. Oh, well, that's not good. Oh! I could just waltz my way out. Okay. That's fine, I guess. But I probably need to heal myself. Let me go to the shop and get some stuff. So that way I can be better at this. And you guys can tell I'm quite bad at this game. I'm really bad at this. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how I'm doing this. I'm just getting screwed. I don't like that. Anything special, Papyrus? Oh! Where could that human have gone? Wait, it's right in front of me! Hello, I was worried that you had gotten lost. It sure is a relief to know that you're right there. Wait a second! You're not supposed to escape! Get back there! <laughs> oh, Papyrus. Give up or face my special attack. Oh god. I don't really want to know what that is. God damn it. I'm gonna get captured again, will I? Ah, oh, no! Come on! No! I'm barely, barely making it. Goodness me. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. I'm not liking the look of that. I'm not liking the sound of that. He's cackling. Oh boy. Not too long and I will use that special attack! This is your last chance before my special attack! I don't like the sound of that. But you know what? Whatever. Uh, should I eat that cinnamon bun? Why not? Behold my special attack! What the heck? That's my special attack! Huh? Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching them on that bone, y'all. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! You old whippersnapper, get back here! Well, that's unfortunate for you, Papyrus. Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. He's getting regular, ready for a regular attack. Oh, here's my absolutely normal attack. Wow, I kind of feel bad for you. Ooh, oh! This is your- this is supposed to be your regular attack. Actually, this looks kind of funky. This is what you call- Oh, hey, buddy! Cool. Slide. Awesome. That's his normal attack. What the heck? Oh, I could just keep going. I didn't see that one, but I cut through that. Wow. Any more? Okay. 
Okay, it just went by. Is that it? Well, uh, it's clear you can't uh, defeat me. Ooh, what an exercise. Good lord. That was supposed to be his normal attack. That normal attack felt like something else, but... Can't think I'll tell my head what it was. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the Great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, Hillman. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Are you sure, buddy? Spare, okay. Alright, cool. I guess we're cool now, right? Yo ho ho! I can't even stop someone as weak as you! Undying is going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? I'm not gonna call I'm not gonna call him a loser. He doesn't deserve to be called that. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then. I guess. I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowie! We haven't even had our first date! And I've already managed to hit the friend zone. Who knew that I all that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and fight them? <laughs> That's what you call friendship, buddy. <laughs> to give them awful puzzles. Even he's criticizing his own puzzles. I can't. Oh, Papa, you're such a great person, I swear. You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like me, probably. Like you! Exactly, Papyrus. You, you already know the deal. That's why the king wants an, to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you'll have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is. Well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Are you talking about Asgore? Because that's probably who you're talking about, right? Everybody loves that guy. I'm a, I am certain if you just say. Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer. That's not who I thought it was. That's actually the final, final boss, I'm assuming. Oh boy. Dreamer. We're gonna be with that fella. Not soon, but... Maybe soon, depending on how far I get through this series, but... We'll get there eventually. Can I please go home? It'll guide you right to the bearer himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. Yeah, I will do that, but not in this video because I just, I just like how he just breaks logic and just walks through the water like Jesus. I, I got, I love Papyrus so much, guys. Probably one of, my, if not my favorite characters in the game. Actually, he's probably a second, a close second to somebody that we're gonna see soon. Not in the next video or what happened in this video or the last video, but. When we get to the hot and spicy area, <laughs> you know what I mean, guys. Okay, so after this Papyrus fight, I was originally going to end the video here for part two. But you guys already know the jizz. This is not part two, and this is part three. And there's a lot more to this video. But you might be wondering why I didn't put this fight into part two when it felt like it was perfect and all that. Well, let me ask you, dear viewer. The reason is simply for the fact that part two was monstrously long. And part three is also monstrously long. But there's a reason to why it was put in here, because there's a lot to this papyrus section than what meets the eye. And I didn't really know exactly how I was going to format this video and really the others. Let's just say I got a little crazy in this series after this one, if you know what I mean. Not, not in the, the, you guys know what I mean. So, for this reason, um, this is in the video here. So, if you hear me say, oh, this papyrus fight was the last part, or the last video, or whatever, um, this is basically why. So, I, I hope you guys are not mad at me, I hope you don't put your pitchforks right in my face for that, I just, I wanted to clarify this, so that way you guys know ahead of time what's going on. And, uh, I I'm really sorry, guys. Uh, 
please forgive me. Please. I'm, I'm sorry for the, the confusion and the, the absolute chaos of this series. I'm gonna try to um, do the best I can with it, okay? Moving on. Also, I should go without mentioning that this is the part that I go and decide to meet Papyrus for the date. But, oh wait, first before we talk to him, let's actually check up here, because I didn't do that last time. Last video, if you will. Um, what's this? Ah, to be young again, the world should have felt boundless. What was that? I heard a snow noise. Let's play Monsters and Humans. I like that game, though, but no. You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? What is that snow sound? I hear... Oh, is that you? Oh, it is. Can I talk to you? Oh, wait, that's why the ice was going through the river? Oh, I had no idea. You're a very interesting creature, I could tell you that. Alright, well, I guess I'll go this way then. There's also this. I don't know what that is. Hello? Anybody? No? Okay, sure, I guess. I don't know what that's all about. Oh, yeah. The library. What's in here? Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. Wait, is it? Library. <laughs> Why didn't you change it then? Was this just recently? Oh, hey, it's Mike Wazowski again. Now ah, look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? Perhaps... Perhaps not. I don't know. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it in with comics and games. How oh, nice. <laughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Good on you then. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. Weird, but okay. You know, I could tell now who's lazier and who's not by the mailbox. I, I no, I could tell who who doesn't do their mailbox and who does. It's pretty obvious who it is, guys. Anyway, hello, Papyrus. We meet again. The fact that you're taller than me is a little weird. Actually, that that's fine. That's basically you, but. Whatever, I guess I'll talk to you again. Because you wanted me to, right? So you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I am, because I, I love you, okay? I love you a lot. Maybe not too much, but I do. Oh, I... Please don't take that out of context, though, guys. Please don't. I beg of you. I... I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Where? Oh. Okay, let's go. To the end! Nope, never mind, not the end. Uh, to the library! Nope, not the library. My house! Hey, at least we got a little exercise there, I guess. <laughs> I just... I like how he just goes in and just shuts the door for me. Like, that's so nice of him. You don't have to open the door for me. You could just shut it right in my face. That's very nice. Just... <laughs> Let's get in the house. Ooh. Well, it's an interesting place. Welcome to scenic- my house. Enjoy and take your time. Alright. What's this? That's my room. If you've finished looking around, we can go in and do whatever people do when they date. Uh, not right now. That sounds a bit odd. But whatever. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. Is this Sans room? Sounds like he's- it looks like he's practicing some very crazy things in there. Probably doing it, um, just to s kill me. Let me try that again. You know, it, this has to be Sans' room. And I can only imagine what those fire are- those fiery looking things are. I'm assuming he's trying to practice killing me when we get to the genocide route. I know that's what he's gonna do. But, I don't know, maybe he is, maybe he isn't, I don't know. But, I'll leave that door- I'll leave that alone, I guess. Okay. TV. Oh, it's my favorite game show! It says, stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode, and don't judge me! 
<laughs> okay, what's this? This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed <laughs> As usual, I have to take responsibility. It's covered in sprinkles. How nice. What's this? It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Heck yeah! Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside... Inside the quantum fix physics book was another joke book. You look inside... There's another quantum physics book! You decide to stop. Okay, it got a little trippy. I think it's a bookception, guys, but I don't know. What is this? It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock! Okay! Don't put it back down, move it! Okay. You moved it two inches! Move it to your room! Okay. And don't bring it back! Okay, I like how he's just saying okay over and over again. It's still here! Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it! Wow. What's this? Ooh. Ah. Okay. What? What? A, okay. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a qui a qu quiche, but filled with sugary non-egg substance. How absurd! How absurd of you, sons. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit at any time. Okay. Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please pursue a culinary art show. Half the fridge is filled with containers and labels spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink! Oh, you did. I didn't even realize it was a sink. I thought it was a closet. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see! It's the dog again. Do, 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 What?! Catch that meddling canine! <laughs> Curses! <laughs> Sands! Stop plaguing my life with incidental, incidental music! God, that, that, okay. <laughs> oh lord, oh man, this is amazing. You touch the couch, it makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the, Ooh. you got 20G! Oh, how nice. Okay, well, let's go in your room now. Alright. Go inside, yes -a Ooh. Got a nice room in here, it's very fiery and all that. You like fire, don't you? That really explains his personality, doesn't it? What's this? The internet! I'm quite popular there! I'm just... a dozen away! From a double-digit fla flower count. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has beside it my online persona. Always sending me bad puns and goofy fonts! How weird. <laughs> if it's papyrus, I swear to god. <gasps> oh boy, hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it's bas it basically just happened. Yeah, you're right. Even though it'd be last episode in this case, but I digress. That's my bad. If I ever get to the surface, I like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun in my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. But you don't have the hair, though. No, oh, whatever. Oh, collections. Ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa. If you got rid of the T and the A, it would be somebody else different. Maybe his brother, I don't know. <laughs> Did you guys ever think about that? Even though he, if you had, if you put the S... You know what, I'm not gonna go deep into that. That's books! One of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. Okay. What's in here, though? There are no skeletons inside my closet. <laughs> Except me sometimes. Look in the closet. Sure. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Oh, how nice. Nothing suspicious, I see. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Begin the date? Well, uh, uh, 
Uh, hold on a second, actually. Take your time. I'll wait for you. Okay, wait, there's one more thing I want to look at. This. Is it that flag, Nito? Undying found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world? Now I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you're right, Papyr. Wait a minute. Wouldn't you be a human too if you were a former- Wait a minute. Okay, that's getting a little trippy. I don't know about that. Maybe, but let's not get to that territory. All right, let's 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 start the date now. Yes. Okay, dating start. Dating start. Oh, here we are, or on our date. Yeah, I've actually never done this before. But don't worry, you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Yeah, let's see. Step one, press the C key on your keyboard. My stat. Whoa, what is all this? Wowie, I feel so informed. I think we're ready to for step two. Crime. Egg. Population. Reel it in. Stat and a doge radar for whatever reason. Okay. That's a lot to think about, but okay. Step two, ask them on a date. Ahem. Human, I, the great papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes. Oh, uh, really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part three. Uh, why would I ever say no to him? He's such a nice guy. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Mm. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandage hanging off of you. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. Yeah, because I don't want to be naked, okay? <laughs> I know how much you like to think that way though, but no. Not, that's not me, though. No! Could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning! Yes? No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! Your dating power! Whoa! Oh god, I'm, I'm destroying him. Nyeh, nyeh. Don't you think you've bested me yet? I, the Great Papyrus! I've never been beaten at dating, and I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes, just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Oh. Yeah, what do you think of my secret style? I love it. No! A genuine compliment! No! How could you? <laughs> However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Move and inspect with Z. Uh, hmm. What's in your hat, though? My hat? My hat? My hat? Yeah! Well, you found my secret! I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Open it. I have to. What is that? Do you know what this is? Oh, I know what it is. It's spaghetti! Of course! Spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Is it? Right! Oh, it is. But, oh. Oh my god. But, oh, so wrong! This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silken spaghetti finally aged in an oaken cask. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Again with the Master Chef. Gordon it's would be so proud of you. I know he would. Yeah, man, it's time to end this. There's no way this could go any further. Eat it! You take a small bite. Your face reflectively, reflexively scrunches up. Ugh. The taste is indesirable. What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! Uh, uh, no! Oh, it's overloaded. Oh god. I just, I just I killed the virus. Human, it's clear now! You're madly in love with me!
<laughs> everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't like the way you like me. Romantically, I mean, I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then on the day, feelings would lose some forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. A maze with no end. A prize with no exit. I screwed that up again. Damn it. I, I, uh, this is not the series of FNAF. I gotta stop doing that, okay? How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait! That's wrong! I can't fall at it, fail at anything! Human! I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being cool, being your cool friend. And act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't be... Don't cry because I won't kiss you. Not that I was going to anyway, but... Just a theory. A GAME THEORY! Thank you guys so much for what- No, I'm joking. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. Alright, thanks, Papyrus. Oh, wait. And if you ever reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me at any time. Platonically. Well, gotta go. <laughs> Alright, bye bye Papyrus. That was awesome. That was so awesome, guys. Too awesome, in fact. Too overkill for this video, for my liking, and for you guys, I would imagine. But I had to do it because it, it, it was a mission. It was an opportunity of a lifetime to have... The greatest night of my life with Papyrus. That guy is incredible. I, I kid you not. One of the best characters in this freaking game. Oh, Monster Kid's gone. That's his name, right? Yeah. He's gone. I'm assuming he's over where Dying is, I, I think, but... Anyway, let's save, because we have to save this awesome experience. I'm not... I don't want to go through that all. I mean, I could go through it all again like a gentleman, but... We're just gonna go with that. Actually, how much do I have in my bank? 90 G. Ooh. And I got two people's contacts. How nice. Uh, but anyway, let's go to the section that you guys have all waited uh, for this episode to be. I could have just used the igloos, can I? Whatever. Not a big deal. It's fine. Flower? No flower. Okay. Moving on now. Alright, now we're finally here. We're finally on to something. And this is where the ice ends, supposedly. Maybe not, but it's where it goes. Oh! Oh, oh, okay, sure. It's Monster Kid again. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome, she's the coolest, right? I wanna just be- I wanna be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. Uh-huh. I won't. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. <laughs> This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. It certainly does, doesn't it? Hey, let's talk to Sans. What do you want? What? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to Grillby's. Wanna come? No, oh, will I ever? Hell yeah. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here. I know a shortcut. Okay. Well, that was quick. Fast shortcut, huh? I guess you're breaking the logic, but that's perfect. That's exactly who you are anyway. The guy who breaks logic. Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Hi, Sans. Oh, I'm a woman. I am Dog Rita. <laughs> Greetings, Sans. Are you Sansy? Hey, Sans. Weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? 
No, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Ha 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 ha. Here, get comfy. Comfy with the whoopee cushion, I guess. Whoops. Watch where you sit down, buddy. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? I like fries, but burgers... Burgers or fries, what do you think? I'm going for fries. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Real big. We'll have a double order of fries. He's calming his non-existent heresy. So, what do you think? Of my brother? He's rather cool. I just had a date with him and it was really awesome. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. Maybe, but I don't I don't think I want to be go that route. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. Oh, Papyrus, you're something else, aren't you? Alright, here's our food. Here comes the grub! Want some ketchup? Yes! Bon appetit! You tip the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in your bottle pours onto your food. Oh, it's fine. I like it that way anyway. Whoops! Uh, forget about it! You can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. I mean, I like ketchup- I like the overdose ketchup though, but okay. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree, Papyrus tries real hard. I like how he keeps trying to be a part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard, and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Sealing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, uh, still the work in progress, though. Interesting. Oh, news is gone. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Like what, Sans? Who? Have you ever heard of, ta of a talking flower? Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Actually, yes I have. So you know all about it. The Echo Flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them. And they'll repeat it over and over. Oh, that's not exactly what I was thinking of, but okay. What about it? Well, Paris told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement. Predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using the echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. If it isn't... Wait a second. Flowey's an echo flower, but... Different? Or is that just Sans being different about... I, uh, I'm sure Sans knows the whole deal, but... He just doesn't want to admit fully what it is. Which is fine, I respect. Whatever. Flowey will be a mystery to me, I guess. Maybe, but I think maybe we figured it out. I don't know. Anyway, well, that was a good long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. That's fine. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? Just what? <gasps> Holy sh... 10,000 G. I'm sorry, Sans, but I can't. Just kidding. Grilby, put it on my tab. Wow. Save that for later, I guess. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. <laughs> okay. That's it. Fine. It's fine, Sans. You could have it that way. Let's take the shortcut like what I should have done. Actually, yeah, let's take the shortcut. Whoop. And away we are, and out we hear. Nice. nice. All right, let's save now. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. It certainly does. All right, can I talk to you again? Let's hang out again sometime. Okay, that's all you say. Can I go back here? There's something... Wait a minute, is that the shortcut? There's something behind his shop, and I just realized that might... But then... But wait, how do... How would it be the shortcut if we just... Again, Sans defies logic. I'm sure this is not the short... God, ooh. Ooh. This is a box. Okay, I, I didn't need to read that. Oh, sincerely a box here. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on a second. You can put an item in it or take an item out. Why would you, though? 
You can't use items when they're hiding in a box! Okay, that's very interesting. Can I pass this area? Wait. Oh, I think I know why that thing down there is there uh, is for. Ugh. Okay, we gotta avoid the rocks! And just like that, we did it. Like a pro. Awesome. Oh. Okay, we're getting some- we're getting into some weird... Situ- oh. <gasps> is that who I think it is? I am dying, I'm here with my daily report! Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? Yes, of course I did. I fought them violently. Valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Well, n no. I tried very hard on dying, but in the end, I failed. W w what? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But on dying, you don't have to destroy them, you see? You see? Uh, I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Uh-oh. Uh... I don't feel like moving now, because I feel like Undying's gonna take that and realize that I'm here. I, that's exactly what's gonna happen, right? <gasps> oh, yep! I knew it! I called it! Oh, shoot. <laughs> hey, Undying, don't be mean to me, okay? Oh, no. Oh, God, no! Oh. Okay, so that concludes part three, everybody. <laughs> a weird way to end it, but of course, an interesting way to start part four, hopefully. And, um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'll catch you guys in another one. Bye bye